Hello friends, it's Christy. Welcome to Bitly Ditly Has Plans. In today's video, we are planning the week of April 17th through the 23rd in my Plum Paper Vertical Columns. So let's get started. Alrighty friends, so for this week, I am using Fern Creek Stickers. It's kit Fantasy Florals, and this is from the Advent Calendar, and I have a stack of sheets here, friends. So basically, this Fantasy Florals pattern or kit style came in like a two-week kit. So I've got a ton of things. Let me show you. I've got a page of deco pieces here. I've got sort of the transparent, functional things like dots and hexagons and arrows and that kind of thing. Here's the deco in a transparent piece. I've got two sheets of thick washi. This one I've already trimmed down because I think I'm going to use this one this week. So I've got these. And I did a whole haul video of this advent calendar. I'll put a card up there for you to see. But I've got two sets of dates there, date covers, and then some more like journaling type date covers. A full sheet of all of these functional boxes, some decorative, what are these quarter boxes and then half boxes so the same kind of sheet and then some habit trackers here some check boxes lots of check boxes down here and then this is more like a journaling type deco page and then i've got two sheets of different full boxes some little pieces down here that's like a little scalloped washi and then down here are some little flags a full sheet of icons with lots of fun things in here and then a full sheet of scripts. So lots to plan with here. So I'm going to get started with, let's see, let's go back to where the dates are. I think it's on, here we go. I was going to start with sort of the more lavender color way. And then I thought maybe the more blue one I might use like later in the year. And let me see, I think what I want to do is I have also, sorry, I should have done this first. There came, it, the advent calendar came with two different sets of washi. I'm gonna crack these open real quick. Okay, so there's this really thin washi here, two kind of florals with sort of that lavendery kind of purpley background. And then this is more of the blue green. This is pretty, I like this scallop with the silver there. So I think what I'm gonna do is, I think I'm gonna put, a strip of this really skinny washi down, if I can find the end. Okay, I think I finally found it. And then let's see if we, you know what? I wonder if this will, oh, I think that'll be okay. The peach kind of color there in the background just kind of actually deepens the pink. So let's just, that and we'll put this down here today is actually sunday the 16th yeah <laughs> i was like what day of the week is it and i just got back we had a family brunch with a cousin of mine who came in from out of town and it was so nice to see her we were visiting there's a little restaurant around the corner from my house and so we all met a bunch of us met there and it was really nice because she's from my dad's side of the family. We don't get to see them very often. And it was just nice kind of catching up. This is cute. I like this. Okay, so let me flip the book. We'll do this side. So that was really fun. Kind of a nice little Sunday. We finally are having some nice weather here. The rain has stopped for a little bit. I don't know if we'll be getting more rain or not. Oh, I hope my hair wasn't just in the camera frame, friends. Sorry, I realized... I was leaning up close, oops, leaning up kind of close to my camera there. Okay, let's see. There we go. That's pretty. Okay, so let's, I'm gonna put these down. Just do it while the book is upside down. So yeah, it was fun to spend family time. My brother, he's the youngest of us, first four. He had been on a like a 15 day cruise to Hawaii with his family and his in-laws. And so I hadn't seen him. It's the one that I used to bowl every Sunday with. And so I hadn't seen him in a while. So it was good to see them. They were laughing. We were talking about, 
how much eating and how just you get so full on a cruise. And we were like, how is that for 15 days on a cruise? Like, that's a lot of eating. And we were joking because my nephew, who is, I think he's 22 now. She said, my sister-in-law said that he weighed before and after and had gained like, I don't know, 13 pounds. This is a Tombow pen. It's 673. So it's like, oh my gosh. That's crazy. I thought this kind of was a nice coordinating, softer tone of this dark, darker lavender here. So that's why I picked this one. Okay, and then this around. So that was kind of funny. Just coloring this in. Okay, so there's that. I did not go on a walk this morning, but I still have time. It's early afternoon now. So I still have time to do that. Okay, and then for here, I thought I could use, let's see, oh, let's do, maybe we do another strip of that, another strip of the skinny, like just kinda, I could do the blue, but I kinda feel like I kinda wanna stick with this colorway. You know what I wanna look at? I don't think, yeah, no, that's not long enough. It only covers three boxes. I was gonna see if I could use this little scallop, but let's see, because I don't think there's any other washi here. These are all boxes. Okay, I could do, I kinda wanna use this down on the, let's see, do I wanna use that one down on the bottom? I thought I kind of had this figured out what I wanted to do, friends, but apparently I don't. Or, ooh, I could use this one on the bottom. Oh, that might be kind of neat. I'm going to do this. I trimmed this down, but I don't know. It's kind of still wide. Maybe what I'll do is I'll just do... Because I don't want to... Yeah, that's too wide for my to-do, so I'm going to leave this. I just need a thin piece. So I'll do this again. Oh, I just realized that there's like a, a, a direction on here. I wanna make sure I don't put this on upside down. So I'm gonna do this again here. Oh, that'll be a nice little frame to this. Oh my gosh, friends. So if you're wondering what I've been doing, Sophie has gotten me hooked on that Love is Blind. It's a Netflix series. It's just like kind of, it's kind of trash reality TV, but she has gotten me hooked on it. So we watched season four and then we went back and started with season one. And I, I binged that last night. She had a babysitting gig, so she wasn't home. So I had to call her and I was like, do you mind if I watch Love is Blind? Like continue watching where we left off and you can catch up later. <laughs> But it's kind of funny. Sophie and I like to binge TV together, so that's where I've been spending my time, just watching reality TV with her. Well, I don't know how reality you'll cons you consider that show, but I don't know. If you watch it, let me know. It's so funny, though. Oh, my gosh. You're like, no, I don't want her to end up with him. Okay, and then I have all of my usual scripts here from Saya Planning, and I've got a habit tracker there from Orange Umbrella Co. So let me put my little to-dos down here. So yeah, we started binging that. And the other night she had, cause this was the last week of her, I'm gonna put my Erin Condren cover under there cause it's starting to get lumpy. She had asked one of the younger siblings of one of Emma's friends to be her honor guard at the farewell mass at their school. And so they spent the day together, like the senior will take the younger girl out and you know, maybe they'll get ice cream or in this case, Sophie and Olivia went and got their nails done. and. She made her a little gift basket of like candies and little hair masks and face masks and that kind of thing. It's really sweet. Um, so anyway, she was over at the house. I think it must have been Friday. And I came home from work and she was over. And so we ordered sushi takeout and binged like season four of Love is Blind. And then after that, we were hooked. So I am going to put, I cut these check boxes between four and three. And because this is gonna be a busy work week, there's probably not a lot of 
like errands and things around the house that I'm going to get done. The one thing that we do need to do is Sophie still has not dropped off her dress for alterations for prom and she needs to get that in. The alterationist in our neighborhood, she'll get really busy because it's everybody's prom season and then I'm like, you're not going to get your dress done on time or we'll be cutting it too close and that makes me nervous. She just needs the straps to be adjusted. She doesn't need it to be hemmed my lucky girls they're they're more apt, like I'm super short friends I think I've told you that and my girls though are more like five four I swear Emma's grown though I feel like she's taller now and maybe it's just because I don't see her all the time but when I do see her I feel like she's gotten taller like she's probably more five 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 six but anyways they're a little more average height so they don't have as many issues with clothes that you know are too long for them <laughs> Okay, so you know what I want to do is maybe I'll use this up here because I'm thinking I might use this to run down the border here. I think that'd be kind of cool. Or let's see, I could use, oh, I think I want to use this. I was going to say I could use this one that I trimmed, but I feel like I want to see what this looks like. Let me get this open. I don't know why I struggle so bad with opening up washi. <laughs> Okay, so let's just put this like this. Okay, and then I'm gonna tear this little end off because it's just sort of the, the starter end. Ooh, that's pretty, I like that. It's interesting because there's that peach in the background. See how it made it look darker? So it kind of looks different. I kind of like that. Makes it look like I have two different washies down. Okay, and then this one we'll put here. Washi is so thin, I notice it like stretches and like when you're putting it down, if you're not careful, it'll even like kind of waver a little bit. This is really pretty. That's cute, I like that. Okay, so now let's decide which weekend banner I'm gonna use. We can find that. There's so much going on in this kit. There's so many pages. Okay, so I think I'm going to stick with sort of this lavender theme, so I'll just go ahead and use this one. Because I feel like, I don't know, I always like to do my bluey type kits in June. I don't know why. That's my dad and Scott's birthday month, so maybe that's why. Okay, so there's that, and then I want to use this. I thought this was so cool. I think what I'm going to do is put this down like this. This is perfect, and then I have sort of that torn look on top there. Yeah, so I, yesterday, this weekend was kind of like the first week in a long time, one, that we've been home, and two, that I feel like I've gotten, like, all my house things done that I wanted to do. So, you know, I got my vacuuming and my dusting and all of that done on, like, my regularly scheduled day, and I woke up this morning early, and I did... I scrubbed the two bathrooms downstairs and I ran to Costco real quick and then came back and showered and got ready for the brunch with my cousin. So I feel really productive and now I spent my afternoon like prepping and filming videos. Okay, so let's do my dots. I um, I didn't get my video up for Easter week, so I'm going to do like a memory plan of that. So after I get this week filmed, I'm going to do that one next. Okay, and I realized that I did my rings wrong. Last week, I did the blue before the green, and the green's supposed to go in the middle. So, oops on that one. <laughs> okay, and then the blue. I still don't quite understand what this hours means. Like, there's 10 hours that you're supposed to stand, and I don't know if it's once every hour or what. I don't know what that is exactly. Okay, so there's that. This is looking cute. I like this so far. All right, so now the sidebar. So let's look at these cute boxes that we have because we have so so many okay so I kind of want to use one of these like this is pretty I like this let's do this let's see oh you know what I wonder again I think this is too wide let's get some of that skinny washi where'd that skinny washi go here it is and let's put some of this down I'm just using the heck out of this 
which is fun. It's hard because it is directional, so I want to make sure that the little plants are going the right way, the little leaves are standing up the right way. And then let's put this down here. And then I'm going to wipe this out a little bit up here because I think it'll show through. It's a hot mess. I'm like, where are my tools? Okay, so there's that. And let's put this one down here. Oops. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this and then I'll trim that end. There we go. this little bit here off. Okay, so there we go. That's sweet. Okay, and then I did pull a habit tracker from Orange Umbrella Co. And again, I picked one that was kind of in this family here. So we'll put this down. Oh, and I'm done with that sheet. I went through and kind of consolidated some of my habit trackers because I have gone through quite a bit of those sheets. Those were such a, these, these are such a great find that I found them, they were on sale at one point. And so I just like stocked up on them. Okay, so now let's see. I've taken reading off for now because friends, let's face it, I haven't been reading. So I am really trying to focus on water because I feel like I just have a lot of sodium in me lately. And then I am taking vitamins. So along with my horm going back on my hormones, I've been taking like a magnesium supplement. So there's that. And then let's do Otis's meds. I thought we could use like one of these pretty colors again, because I think it kind of coordinates well with the kit. There's that. And then we'll do walk. He's still not walking great, but with the weather getting better, I noticed like this weekend, he wanted to play more in the evening like we used to. Like our routine was when it, once we got dinner kind of done and settled in, he would come and we would play and like play tug of war and all this. And so he's kind of gone back to doing that, which is nice. I'm now looking for the scripts, friends. Okay, so let's see, do we have a this week? Let's see, take out grocery shop. Oh, there's a bunch of little to-dos, to-goes, to-calls, day off, meal plan, this week. Here we go. I'm going to use this one. And what can we put this on, friends? I kind of want to put it on something. Let's see. I kind of want to put it on one of these. I want to cover this. So let me just white out the ends here a little bit. because they're kind of showing. I'm gonna put this down here like this. And I'm gonna put this on top. There we go, that's cute. Okay, oh, while I'm here, let's highlight the week that we're in, which is the 17th through the 22nd. So yeah, I wanted to get my work week coming up planned, and then I'm gonna go back and do a memory plan of Easter week. Okay, so that, looks like my base I think friends yeah that's pretty good that's looking pretty good okay so there's a lot going on so let me find the sheet with all of my schedule going on here so I think this is one of them this is one of them we've got icons will do last and then let's see yep and then this is one of them. Okay, so I have a pre-con for my legislative day on Monday, first thing. So I'm going to put this here. I'm going to lay these things down since it's kind of a busy week. And then we'll see what I have room for in terms of like boxes and layering. Okay, and then Tuesday we've got health IT, health equity. Tuesday's going to be just screaming busy. We've got catering coming in for a group. 
And then I actually have Calpac. Our Calpac has a lot of stuff going on. They have a meeting. Their board of directors is meeting, and then we have a reception. So I'm going to put that in here. This is why I wanted to lay these down first instead of doing the layering of the boxes like I normally do just because there's a lot to stack. Okay, so there's that. And then, okay, so then on Wednesday, it is my younger brother's birthday. So we'll put his up here. And I feel like there was a happy birthday that I saw in here. Binge watch, oh, I love those. Here it is, happy birthday. Let's see, I'm gonna put this one on here. Okay, I think he's turning 27. And then, let's see. Okay, so this is my ledge day here on Wednesday. So I just did one of these big boxes and filled it in with a ton of stuff. So there's that. And then on Thursday, I have lunch with my girlfriend. So this is my birthday lunch. We always get together for our birthdays. And our friend Gilda is retired. So it's kind of, we've had to do like her birthday's in February. And I don't think we got together until like after her birthday. <laughs> like we probably got together in March. And so now we're not getting together until April for my birthday. But it's fine. As long as we get together, that's what matters. And then I have a three o'clock. Let's see. Where'd that other sheet go? Here we go. Our foundation is celebrating their 60th year, so we're meeting to discuss some possible events for that. And then Friday, I have lunch with my girlfriend, Becky, who used to work with us. And then she went over to an a, like a affiliate association. Okay, oh, and then my setup. I have this in between all of these things. I think I'm gonna put this like right here. So at some point, some of us will peel off from the CalPAC stuff and go set up for ledge day. Okay, so there's that. And then on Sunday is my nephew Willie's birthday. So he's turning, he's turning 19. Yeah, because Emma's turning 20. So he's a little bit, a couple months younger than Emma. Let me see. I think there was another happy birthday. Happy birthday. Where, where, here we go. Let's put this one here on Willie. Oops. Okay, so there's that. Alrighty. What else do I have going on? There's a lot. Okay, so now let's take a look at these other scripts because I want to find Trash Day. Put that on there. That's Wednesday. I don't have a payday here. And I think we recycled last week. Yeah, so we don't have to recycle this week. And then let's see what else is in here. New school next week. Order to call meal plan. I think the rest of these I can just hang on to and we'll use as the week goes, order stickers, I need to do that actually today because there's a mystery kit out from Fern Creek Stickers that I wanna make sure I catch this weekend. Okay, so that's that. And then let's take a look at all the fun icons. Let's see, I think I wanna use this lighter shoe. And because it's facing this way, I'm gonna put them over here. There's that. And then let's put some balloons down. Like that. And then let's use these other ones here for my brother. We'll put them on this side. And then what else do we have? This is cute, the little doggy bag. I like that. Okay, I think that's all I have for right now. So cute. Okay, so I think that's the base of my week. It's crazy week though, just because of all the meetings going on here and the lead up into that. So let's take a look at some of this other stuff that I have, like some boxes and things. And let's see, there's um, 
Let me find them. There's so many sheets here that I have to go through, friends. And then there's this deco. I wonder what these, like, they're pretty transparent, though. Like, I wonder what they'll look like if I... How much will show through, like, the lines of my planner. Oh, that's really faint. It's pretty, though. Okay, so let's see. I kind of like... It's hard to tell, like, should I use more of the lavender-y type of... I'm going to put this down here because I want to block a lot of my day and not be able to schedule anything, <laughs> if that makes sense, friends. And then I do like this color here. I like this blue. This is cute. I'm going to put this down here. So this is, I'm doing a little more traditional, kind of just keeping the boxes vertical. I do want to put this one in here. I like this one a lot. So I'm going to put this in here. You know what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to trim that top off a little bit. So let me turn the book here. And I'm just going to trim this off right where... That washi is. It's not much. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Almost reaching that kind of midpoint of my book. Okay, and then this blue one, let's do something like this. Uh, I really like this one here. <laughs> I'm going to put this down here under Becky so that I can kind of, like I said, block my afternoon. I try to like block my time where people aren't scheduling me. There we go. And then for the weekend, we could do something. Let's see what do I have going on here. I like kind of how I've sort of spread them out a little bit. I kind of want to put this one down. I think this next weekend I want to go see my dad. I haven't taken flowers to my dad in a long time just because our weather was so bad and then I got super crazy with work. I think I'm going to put this here. Actually, should I? No, I'm going to put it here. I'm gonna put this one in here. There we go. And then I do wanna put some more of these down. Let's see, oops. Like these little flowers here or something. This is a little tiny one. The This translucent paper is a little bit harder for me to peel up. Like I, my fingers kind of stumble with it a little bit than, you know, the paper. There we go. Just want to put some of these down. I think I'm going to use one that's not quite as see-through. I think I'm gonna put this one down because I kind of like this one. I'm gonna put this right here. I don't care that it doesn't give me any room for this week. <laughs> All right, that's enough playing around because I wanna leave some white space just in case some things pop up. So again, this was enough for two weeks. So still a ton left in terms of boxes and I've got journaling pieces and wide washi that I had kind of trimmed and then some translucent dots and then lots and lots of labels here friends plenty as you can see to do two full weeks and all of the functional check boxes more wide washi and the other set of date covers so lots going on alrighty friends let's pull this out 
yeah, I think this will get my week started. So already busy week ahead for me with conferences going on. All right, friends, I think that's it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe so you can catch future content on my channel. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.